Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to build a uh, mild derby car interior. So you're just going to go from this basic to that right there. Um, so today we'll be doing the four point cage and with the bar down the middle with the shifter. That's what we'll be doing today. So let's get to it. And we'll be uh, cutting some stuff. You don't have to cut it if you don't want to, but we'll be building a pro mod. So, yeah. So today you will need um, some cutters. Um, like. These are tin cutters for cutting the uh, trunk, cutting the back seat out. If you don't want to do the uh, trunk, the um, the trunk thing, you don't have to. You don't need those. But yeah, so and you need a hot glue gun and some markers to color your cage. So, first thing you need to do is, uh, you're just gonna, cause I don't know if you guys can see that, uh, do I have a, oh, think okay. I, so, you, there's like a, there's like a crease behind the seat. That's where you're gonna cut it. Um, but yeah, once you cut it right there, you're gonna cut it on the other side too. And then you're just gonna cut all the way. All the way. Like, just cut a straight line. And um, so, I'll get back to you guys when I finish that. And so, yeah, I just finished cutting that. That's what it'll look like. Just cut behind the back seat. And uh, sometimes if you cut it on both sides and you just peel it back, it should break. If it doesn't, you just have to cut it all the way again. But yeah, no. So now that's out of the way, we can start with putting the gauge in. So... The first thing you would do is get your steering wheel, okay, and you'll take a thing, a styrene that comes with the uh, car, and you just cut off all the things on it, so it's just that, and where the dashboard is supposed to go, there should be, like on mine, there's like that little limp little thing right there and that's where you want to put it or you can put it in the middle it's up to you oh right there but yeah and with this you would put the the end of one right by where you want it and then the other just like that so yeah so um i'll get back to you guys when i have well huh. so if you get what i'm saying you're just gonna glue it right there and right there where you want it on that so i'll get back to you guys when uh mine is done okay guys so i just finished mine that's what it will look like you know just glue it right there and glue it right there no steering wheel is just like that i just have the uh stock steering wheel on there i don't have anything special uh same with my uh but there's just stock steering wheel doesn't really matter um but yeah so with the back you're basically just gonna same with it, just gonna put it right behind the seat. In 
yeah, just right behind the seat, and then cut it where, like, it will fit in there tight. That's where you want to cut it. But yeah, so I just come on in, you see, just might be a little tricky to get in there, but yeah, that's what mine looks like. And Uh oh, but yeah, but yeah, it'll just kind of be straight, just like that in there. So, uh, I'll get back to you guys when I uh color this and put it in there. So, so yeah. Alright guys, so I just finished mine, and it won't always be straight, because you see mine's, mine's a little crooked, but yeah, um, and if crooked's not like good for you, you can always take it, up, take that out, put it, re, put it back in, and just do it again, and if the glue, if the glue is not totally dry yet, you can just move it because it's not too good yet. But, um, so for the sides, uh, you're gonna do is stick a normal thing, just a couple, just scraps you have laying around. It doesn't take that much. But, um, I just have, I'm just reusing the old cage that was in here. Um, so, what you're gonna do is, with the straps, is, you know, put it right, right there, and then you're gonna lean it up against that once you lean it again up against that you can just cut it perfect and sometimes not always it should fit snug but yeah yep my fit snug so fit fits snug in there you just um just glue it in so change glue right in. and if it's i think i showed you if it's too long you just cut it but yeah and um so yeah i'll just get back to you guys when the other side is done okay so i just did the other side basic same thing just yeah, that. And, um, if your steering wheel is too close to the, uh, the indoor panel, you might not be able to put a thing in there. But if you want a bar right there, you can just take out your steering wheel and move it over. And then put your, try, try and put the bar back in. Um, sometimes that usually works, but... Sometimes it doesn't. So, yeah. So, I'm just going to color up something, but I'll get back to you guys when I color. So, I just finished that. Um, so, we're going to do the bar in the middle. So, the Snager Styrene again. And you'll put it in the middle like you did. With your uh, side things, just put it right up in there, and then you'll just cut it. So we're gonna set that there, and then just cut my.
mine. There we go. And it fits snug. So I'll just Yeah, there you go. There's, there it is, and here's your thing. Just popped up, but yeah. So I'll just uh, get back to you guys when I uh, colored it. So I just colored mine and put it in. So what I like to do is I leave in the center console, so I know where to put it, and so it's in the like kind 